Hi Leos, welcome to my channel. We're doing your bi-weekly. In the pre-shuffle, this is 16th to the 31st, there was the Sun card, the Star card, and the Hermit. Now, what does that mean? Um, someone's wish to have some sort of enlightenment is coming. It's more of an enlightenment message. It's like if you're trying to seek for an answer, you're gonna get an answer, okay? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Here we go for my Leos. Okay, let's see. Mm -mm -mm. Here we go. Let's see. Here we go. You have your death card. Mm hmm. Keep dealing with Scorpio. The saga continues. Okay. Let's see what's going on here. You have an idea on how to make things work, make things bright, make things good. It's an idea. It's in the process. Um, I'm seeing here it's about to start new. Interesting because they're telling me about, you know, it's 13. So meaning it passed through the 12 zodiac and the one extra is about starting. You could be dealing with an Aries. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that's, that's what they're saying too. Mm -hmm. Or you have Aries in your chart, you're an Ashwini. Something is about to happen um, over Halloween even over here. Um, the transformation can happen during that time. Okay. Can be with a Scorpio or this person that you're dealing with. It's a revelation about, a, they keep saying idea. I'm not sure about this idea that you have. Three of Cups, ending of a, can be, you know, if you know that you're in a third party, you're in a third party. You don't have to put yourself in one just to resonate with the reading. Okay. <laughs> there should be then, there should, no. If you know there is, then there is. If there's not, um, But this is about what has ended come to fruition with regards to some sort of celebration. It can be like really a Halloween party over here. But if it's not a Halloween party, okay. Um, I'm seeing here that you're connected with someone who's gonna go to a party or they're uh, making a party. If not, this is also a new chance of beginning over here. You see that? And this is a death and rebirth process. This is a birth, okay. And if it's a birth, you could be meeting someone new or you are reconnecting with someone from the past. Let me see here, next to the death card. Six of Wands, could be Leo and uh, Scorpio over here. Now, this energy with this one, in the new path or the new beginning that you're trying to go to, okay, I feel like there's a sense of level of accomplishment, you feel fulfilled, you feel good, you feel like, you know, you're, top of, you're on top of the world. This can be the other person that you're dealing with also. Next to the Three of Cups. Wow, you have a Scorpio over here. Can be a Scorpio is happily seeing you coming towards them. There's a visit here. This is someone who's visiting, if you can see that. Uh -huh. Someone's visiting. You are cornered by a Scorpio over here. If you, um, if it's not a Scorpio, another water sign, Cancer, Pisces. Um, they can't stop thinking about you, but let me see here. And you can't stop thinking about them also. The water sign, if you have a water in your chart, you want to have this new beginning with this person. Underneath the Six of Wands. Judgment, reconciliation, uh, and then another Scorpio. Who's that? Ah, everything is about a Scorpio over here. Death card, judgment, King of Cups. That's intense. Happy Halloween. Okay. <laughs> I feel like it's you who's coming back to this Scorpio because you have the judgment looking at the Scorpio card. You can't be like, well, you could be a double Scorpio also, or whoever is double Scorpio also who's very successful over here, who's received enlightenment. Let me see. Ten of Cups! Ten of Cups. From three to the ten. What's love got to do, got to do with it? Ten and ten and ten. What's the divide? Let's go for the divide, Scorpio. Oh, Scorpio. Leo. <laughs> Sheesh. I'm a Leo. I'm a Scorpio too. I'm a Libra. I'm everything. Why choose one when you have 12? That's what I say. People are so limited with their mind. Just saying, right? Mm-hmm. Limited with their mind. Just saying. <laughs> Little minds. Whole universe. We'll have a talk. 
thousands, galaxies, um, you know, everything out there. And people choose to be one zodiac. That's bullcrap. <laughs> you're missing a lot on your life if you just think you're one. Even you can have many. This is what the message is. You want to be in one group? That's boring. <laughs> boring. That's what it's saying here. Let's see what's dividing you. Okay. Seven of Cups. Confuse. Rahu. That's what's dividing because you're fearful of this. Both are scared. Both have love. Both are bullcrap. That's what I say. Mm -hmm. When you have so much love over here and you guys still don't know how to manage it, it's fear-based, okay? It's not water-based, okay? <laughs> Foolproof, okay? <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> You're a Leo. So, come back. There's someone who went through the death and rebirth process. When I say that, the dark night of the soul, other people call it, right? <laughs> the dying and, oh, I don't want to do this anymore, Sal. I don't want to do this. That has happened. Six of Wands, recovery. I'm doing well, Sal. I finally can get out. You know, I started putting on, um, you know, my nice clothes again. I'm out there, Sal. I'm doing well. Thank you. That's good, this one. The other person over here, in love, crazy in love, madly in love, and fearful of love. Mm-hmm. You see this face? There's no crack. Mm-mm. 24 hours. Okay? It holds. <laughs> The person you're dealing with, or you, if you have water also in your chart, can't stop thinking about this new beginning. It's like, oh my god, this new beginning, this new beginning, this new beginning. Okay? They also can't stop, and you can't stop, since it's what's separating you, about the things that you guys don't talk about. Okay? Why don't we talk? Okay? So that there's no fear, there's no doubt, you know? Communicate. Okay? This is what's separating you. So that you don't constipate. Okay? So I'm going to continue this reading, Leos. As two people try to be together, and also, let me see. Well, there, there is reconciliation here, there's reconciliation. So two people, because there's even love over here. There's ten of cups, so two people love each other. They just have to talk about it. Talk about it, talk about it, talk about it. That's what I'd say. Alrighty. Have a wonderful, wonderful 16 to the 31st. And remember, you're boring if you're only one zodiac. Start owning the 12. That's what I say. Mm -hmm. I'll see you guys again. Leos. Bye. <laughs>